gonna do now, Lug? We're gonna have a brilliant barbecue. I found some ear muffs. Mmm. Looks tasty. No. I'm gonna wear them. What do they feel like? What? Is they nice and warm? What? Oi! Uh-uh. Run! What? <laughs> Ow! Oi! Wait for me! I've had enough. That's the third time today I've caught someone pilfering my rubbish. I'm going to put a stop to it. Now, stand well back and hold your nose. You think I'm not used to your stinky spells? Suit yourself, but don't say I didn't warn you. Pocus, pocus, stinky smokers. Make a smell that's sure to choke us! <laughs> this will teach him. My very own wall of smell. I'd like to see the brave soul who can get through that. We're not going to have much of a fire with just one plank. We'll have to go back again. Come on, there's no sign of a... <laughs> <laughs> oh, nasty! Are you all right, lad? Yeah, uh, I think so. And I'm telling you now, it's my very best work. A great wall of smell encircling the dump. What happens if someone comes up with an antidote? Well, they won't. You'd have to know the recipe before you can work out the antidote. Anyway, as I was saying, <laughs> I think I ought to be given some sort of award. Well, I think it deserved an award. It's not often I come up with something as good as... Look out! <laughs> well, really? One thousand apologies, gracious lady witch. I would scrape the ground with one thousand bows, but alas, my trousers is caught. Well... <sighs> That was some of the worst flying I've ever seen. I've a good mind to report this to the coven. Oh, no need of reporting. Surely we can come to some sort of agreement. The Turkish delight. Oh, don't try and fob me off with that. I know better than to trust a genie. Anyway, shouldn't you be in a lamp? Uh, Ali Pally is currently between premises, my dear. Um... Pong Whiffy. Did you say Pong Whiffy? As in the famous witch Pong Whiffy, creator of the Great Wall of Smell? Well, I. famous. Oh, yeah, very. But what a coincidence. I was hoping to write an article about you for the Genie Journal. Ta da! There it is. Wonderful. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> Oh, to think I'm actually standing here <coughs> choking before it. So, fire away. My readers will be most interested to hear this. How many readers? Hundreds, thousands even. Everyone is talking about the great wall of smell. And my picture will be on the cover, you say? Oh, yeah, with a byline. Paul Whiffy, the witch behind the wall of smell. Perhaps you could tell me a little more about it, just to feed the public curiosity. Well, it's based on a fairly traditional spell, with a few little twists of my own. The basic ingredients, I suppose? Yes, you know, old socks, bad eggs... Of course, I knew it. And do I detect just the tiniest hint of garlic in the wall? Well, yes, you have to have garlic to keep the vampires out. Inspiring. <laughs> uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but do you want to get a whiff of pig's dye? Well spotted, yes. I added four teaspoons of that. You have to be careful, goes off bang with the essence of ashtray unless you add it gradually. Fascinating, fascinating. And apparently he wants to do another article called A Day in the Life of a Witch, all about me. What do you think, toad green or slug yellow? 
Are you listening? What? Oh, yes, the genie. You were saying. Yes, well, I don't normally trust genies, but I really do think this one is an exception. I mean, he really knows how to recognise talent. Hmm. Perhaps the green, after all. Honestly! Does having your name in the genie journal count for nothing in this wood? OK. I'll count. One, six, two, go! <laughs> You're supposed to let go. Come on then, Hugo. Time for the meeting. <laughs> Even celebrities like me have certain obligations. Right. First, the antidote. Next, the publicity. How should I know I can't read? Ali Pali's knockdown dump sale. A pilferer's paradise and no wall of smell. Doesn't that sound... very boring, really? If you want a job done properly, you got to do it yourself. Oh, oh. And, last of all, the money. Pally Pally's knockdown dump sale is officially open. Roll up, roll up, everything must go. Yes, there's going to be a big picture of me on the front. It was my lucky day when I met Ali Pally. Sorry I'm late. But have you seen these? Ali Pally's knockdown dump sale. Everything must go. What? Let me have a look at that. <gasps> Why that no good? <laughs> I'm going to buy this boot. Hello, Plog. Where have you been? How much for this? For you, sir. Special offer. One for the price of two. Yeah. How about one for the price of three? Oh, you drive a hard bargain. Witches! The witches! Witches! Witches are no good for business. No good at all. Closing time, I think. Aha! Mess with my wall, <laughs> would you? Ah, oh, my dear Lady Witch. Don't you dear Lady Witch me. It's about time you went home, Sonny. No! <laughs> She is taking it very well, considering how Dumpy's gone down. Yes. You'd think she'd be sad, wouldn't you? All the time it's taken her to build it up. It's all her own fault. She shouldn't have given him the recipe, should she? 119, 120! <laughs> 120 gold pieces! Oh, my lovely rubbish! I can buy it all back!